I'm here today with the Land Cruiser 79 Series single cab chassis ute and here are three reasons why I wouldn't buy this ute and three reasons why I would. Let's have a look. Okay, I can put up with the fact that it's got a key and the key unlocks only one door at a time. That's all fine. I can put up with the fact that it's got window winders even though they do actually get in the way of me sometimes. I love the quarter window. What is difficult to put up with is these external mirrors. They're just crap and no matter what Toyota tells you, you can buy aftermarket electric mirrors and they're just too, I don't know, cheap to put on new ones. Okay, the second reason why I wouldn't buy this ute is because there's no reverse camera. And in a ute this side with the tray at the back, you can't see the edges of it. It's a recipe for disaster. You need a reverse camera. Okay, the third reason why I wouldn't buy this ute is because no matter what model you look at, you're looking at north of $80,000 on the road, and that's an enormous amount of money for this ute. It's just, it's ridiculous pricing. Okay, let's have a look at the first reason why I would buy this ute. This new 2.8 litre four-cylinder motor is as good, if not better, than the old V8 in about 99.9% .9 of the applications. And we can still get to use it. And along with that four-cylinder motor, you get an automatic gearbox, which is definitely better than the old manual box and you get a whole lot of additional features as well. Second reason why I would buy this ute is because it is built like a tank. There's not a tougher ute on the market than a Land Cruiser 79 series. Okay, the third reason why I'd buy one of these utes is it comes with a huge tray and almost 1400 kilo payload capacity and it'll tow 3500 kilos as well. So there's my three reasons why I would and wouldn't buy this ute. Let me know what you think you would do. Would you buy it or not buy it? Thanks for joining us. We'll see you next time.